Greetings, tank fans. We are in the T-77, which is the uh, prize at the end of season number five, also known as Flashpoint. The uh, T-77 is a tier eight heavy, American tier eight heavy. Reshot uh, auto loader with something on the order of a 40 45 second reload, which you can witness just as soon as I'm done shooting at this guy. The uh, it is also uh, sort of a uh, lumbering heavy, not the slowest tank I've ever seen, but. Uh, nowhere near the fastest. This tank is the prize at the end, at level 100 of Flashpoint, if you bought the uh, Season Pass. Which is why it is uh, the first video I'm putting out, in case you're debating about whether or not to get the Season Pass. I've, uh, if you're interested in the T-59-2, which is the prize at level 75, I did a video on that a long time ago when I, uh, received one as the result of a Twitter drawing. So you can look for that in, uh, in my archive. There. This is about my uh, fifth game in the T-77. Uh, first fewer at uh, Tier 10, Tier 9. We did alright, but uh, not great. Uh, as you may have noticed, I've, put so I've rented some camo paint. And I put a flag on it. I l uh, installed advanced optics. Uh, I've installed uh, advanced camouflage and I've uh, installed reinforced ammo rack because if this thing, as slow as it is to reload, if you get ammo racked in it, uh, you're dead. Uh, I don't like heavies to hang out in the back of the map, that seems uh, unfair. But with this 40, 45 second reload, I had to at least uh, start down there. I don't know how they expect you to play it. Because you're, you're in the middle of a brawl and you've got a 45 second reload. And you're dead. Uh, the reason I've only rented the camo paint is at the end of uh, Flashpoint, they present you with a notice that there is a new op in the op section for earning skin for this tank. Which I don't know, the skin's. Uh, Sometime I like to look at the camel paint better than the skin, so I don't know what we're going to do there, but we'll see. I didn't want to make any firm decisions at this point. Now we've got a little bit of a lead here, but look at the mini-map and see that we got three TDs about where I started the game. And the bad guys are all on the other side of the railroad tracks, and most of them are on this end of the map. So it doesn't feel like we have a lead at this point. The accuracy of the gun is pretty good. I'm not going to play peekaboo with this guy. But if you notice, I'm about to clobber this guy even though I don't see him. 
clobber, I say. Critical damage, anyway. I wanted to sit there on the flag, but being shot at by both of them didn't feel like a winning strategy. Now I'm debating about whether to reload or take this guy on with just my two shots. T the, each shot doesn't do all that much damage. Uh, Percentage-wise, anyone has tier 8 tanks. I've noticed numbers in the uh, high 200s as far as the points coming off the bad guys. I think in a few minutes there'll be a shot where it's in the 400s. But it's been a while since I've been to the optometrist and I'm sitting pretty far from the screen. Also. I have to double check me. seconds I think I saw here on the reload clock. The TDs from that back corner have finally moved up. And I don't think I'm gonna get much more shooting in here. Please uh, consider liking, sharing, and uh, subscribing. Let me know what you think of the T-77. I may do a, a video on the other reward tank, which this minute I don't even remember what it is. So be on the lookout for that. How'd we do? One, uh, one medal. And about the middle of the list. Not showing off. Not doing too bad. Once again, please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.